Chat, what up, chat? Oh shit, my cat's right there. How's it going, chat? How's everybody doing? Chill stream, chill stream today. Feeling a little bit better. Uh, I got COVID last week. Um, so it's been one hell of a week. Feels good to be back though. Excited to build the, uh, the void. This board's sick. I don't know if you guys saw, I posted a, um, like a little unboxing on Instagram, but the board's beautiful. We're going to be using, I don't even know, I, I don't even know what these switches are. Rusty access. These might be B sun switches. Let's see. I don't know why it says rusty access on the box. B Sun Paradise Island Linear Switches. What the heck? That's a lot. Yeah, it's just sick. Cool little box. LY stem, PA66 housing, palm bottom. 3.2 millimeter actuation. So this is going to be a long pole. And I think these are factory lubed. If not, they, oh yeah, they are factory lubed. It doesn't tell you, but they actually, I opened them up and they actually sound really good. All right, chat, let's unbox this. So this is from click clack. They're going to be one of the vendors that are running this, uh, this board. So they sent me a bunch of plates. I'm probably just going to use Alu because that's my favorite and I'm boring and I would just like to use Alu. So we're going to do O-ring on Alu. Um, feet, press in feet, which is cool. It'll hide the screws. It does come with a screwdriver. Um, oh yeah, they did send, I really like this case. So I like how this case has two, like, uh, like two things, two storage things here. It's nice. So they sent a hot swap and solder. We're probably going to use a solder. I really like this, uh, Matt gray look. This is chill. And Araxis Void. I think they said something with the solder. PCB in the build guide doesn't support split backspace. I mean, we don't use split backspace, but it looks like it does. I think it's just the hot swap PCB. Because I know Captain Sterling was having issues. And he was using hot swap. Yeah, it looks like the hot swap. I would use hot swap, but I'm not a huge fan. All right, let me show you guys this board. I sadly got fingerprints all over it. It's like unavoidable. This blue is just beautiful. It reminds me of like the Kaze, but maybe a little bit brighter. It's definitely a click clack color. Nice side profile. I think my, like, I guess it takes inspiration from like the TGR boards, but my favorite are when they have this back piece here and then a big weight. It's like my favorite design. They, they switch it up a little bit. It looks a little different. I like this little cutout right here from the USB. I feel like if it went all the way across, you would like, you might scratch this stainless torque screws money. That's what we want to see. All right, chat. Let's, uh, let's lube up some stabs. 
I'm gonna pop this off real quick off the PCB. Yeah, I hope everyone's doing well. I feel like I haven't streamed about in a couple weeks. Just hasn't been, uh, hasn't been my few past weekends. Um, where are the stabs? Oh, I got this sick artisan cap from unknown caps. To go with, um, what is that? GMK Symbiote. It's like literally perfect. But I love their packaging. It's sick. I haven't taken it out of the packaging yet. I just love this. I kind of want to take pictures. All right, chat. Some TX stabs. I feel like that's all I've been using because all's, all's we've had so far was O-ring build, builds. Do we do 7U on a 65%? We'll do it. All right, so we're good with those. We're going to use some 205 and some BD0. I think that's the move. Got to mix this up. Getting like a little oily at the bottom. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they said GB, the GB is uh, to be determined. I'm sure it'll be soon. Maybe after everybody posts content. I don't know, this board's sick. I just remember seeing it on Geek Hack. See if I still remember how to build a keyboard chat. I don't know if I remember.
Yo, Anaraxis, what up? Welcome, welcome. Thank you for the follow. And good morning, by the way. I know it's super early for you. Got a coffee already? No problem. Hell yeah. I haven't had coffee in like a week. I'm really jealous. Yo, clackbait. What's good? Long time no see. Yeah, I haven't had coffee in like a week because I have, I have COVID. And I just don't feel like drinking coffee. That sucks too because I just bought a bunch like last week. <clears throat> chilling? Yeah, we're chilling. We're big chilling tonight. We're trying to recover as fast as possible here. I want to get content out on this board. This board's fire, by the way. I think it came out really, really good. Is the blue is the blue a uh, click clack color? It definitely reminds me of of their blue. Chai, you know what game I've been playing? Um, I went back and started playing Battlefield 2042. It's actually fun. I had to stop playing COD for like a little bit because I was getting like voice chat banned and all this stupid shit. People just report you. Um... That one game looks really good. Delta Force uh, Hawk Ops. I'm trying to get in on that. But it's like in alpha right now.
Gotta see these wires. I'm curious how well this PCB takes heat. Hopefully it solders quickly. Past two boards haven't. Oh, Chad, I saw Lord of the Rings dropped the new season. I was on my phone right before stream and I saw like a snippet on TikTok. Chris Keeves, yo, what up? Thank you for the follow. How you doing? Ooh, I know, right? It kind of reminds you of the cycle seven. I'd have to break out the board to see how similar it is. Like it reminds me of, of a cook clack. Uh, I don't know why that's so hard to say for me, but it reminds you of one of their blues. Definitely better than Navy. I would never buy a Navy board. Chilla man just wrapped up work. Was thinking of looping some stabs, but what? Well, that's, that's easy. Don't be lazy. I'll get on your shit, yo. Don't don't be lazy. <laughs> I'll tell you how it is. Just bang it out. It'll probably take you twenty minutes. Work is lightweight. I got you. See, I got you. Just bust them out real quick. What are you, uh, what are you building? Or what are you swapping? Ooh, Matrix Corsa, nice. I haven't built one. I used one, uh, like a proto. I used Bad Seeds when I saw him at the meetup, Novel Keys meetup, like a few years ago. <clears throat> Ooh, Space Theme. What keycaps are you going to use? That'll be cool with the uh, OLED.
Uh, <clears throat> let's check it out. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Is uh, DCD is like a little bit more bubbly, bubbly, bubblier. Is that a is that a word? What the fuck? Then cherry. That's pretty cool. That's cheap. Fifty bucks. That's what's up. PBT. That'll last them. Is it pad printed? What is that? I just can't get I can't use those because I can't get away from cherry. I'm a sucker. Oh, ads. That's a fire set. Is the uh it's PPT, but what is the is it pad printed? Like all the like stars or galaxies that are on there? This is a fucked up PCB. I'm so confused. Oh, look, this PCB looks crazy. Are you kidding me? I just broke the shit out of this. The fuck? Never done that ever in my life. I thought I broke it again. Dude, I just blew out. I blew out the bottom little clip. <laughs> Fuck. That's what I get for talking shit about the PCB. All right. Purple tr this? This tray? Uh, American Haptics. You want to use my affiliate link, you can. They're expensive, though. They're like 90 bucks. Oh yeah, these sound good. I've been theming out the builds lately. I've been feeling it. I like it.
Just look them up. They have nice. Yeah, you could. It's. I mean, it's definitely. I think it's definitely worth it. I really like it. I've had this one for a few years now. I also have the Casper one, the clear one. It's just that one. Uh, see, I roll mine up. I roll mine up and put it in like a cylinder thing that a desk mat came in. And when you keep like rolling them up, sometimes they don't like they'll do this a little bit. They stay kind of like up. This one's good. The other one, I don't know if it's because of the material that they used. The it like really, really like lifts on both sides. But I mean, if you want to preserve your desk mats, I'd say it's worth it. It's better than the blue Amazon one everyone gets. Plus, you can customize it. Like, I customize mine. Yeah, I, I had the I had the blue one. Nothing wrong with it. Sometimes it's a little annoying like unrolling this thing, but I you only use I only use it like once in a while anytime I build a keyboard, so Can't mess up this bottom row chat. This side row is going to mess me up. I'm confused. All right, this isn't too bad. All of these switches sound so good. I love B Sun. B Sun's like my favorite. And then HMX. I cherry pick each switch, like where I want to place it. Cause the, I cannot stand when I build a keyboard and then like one keyboard, one switch on the alphas just sounds like ass. Oh, I got to remember to clip in the stabs. Every single switch sounds fire. Uh, I think they're very similar. I think I like B Sun's lubrication a little bit better. And their springs are really good. I mean, I know back in the day, the B Sun switches weren't that great. Like when I would make Holy Pandas. Like the B Sun switches themselves were horrible.
All right, do we have just enough switches here? Uh, we're doing O-ring. Instead of top mount. This is like the third O-ring board in a row. Oh yeah. Wish it was half plate. These switches are so good. They actually lube them the same way I do, I think. Like I literally just, I lube the stem rails and then I lube the legs, that's it. And then I oil the springs. I don't do anything else. I've learned less is more. I'm okay. I, uh, had COVID for about a week. And then the week before that, one of my friends passed away. So we had to, had to bury him. It's been, it's been a tough past two weeks. Trying to hang in there. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, it sucks. He's the one who got me in, like, all of this shit. Com building computers again. Got me my first mechanical keyboard. Pretty much blossomed all this other shit that I do. Yeah, now I have COVID. I left work Tuesday because I had like chills and like body aches. Like I could just tell I was getting sick. Right? You could just taste it. Then basically Tuesday and Wednesday, I was basically bedridden. Yo, thank you, Chris. I appreciate it. Yeah, bro. It's tough. It's hard. Honestly, didn't want to even fire at my PC. And these are tight to get in here. Make me sweat. All right, chat. A solder the sucker. You know what? I'm going to throw some shit out real quick. This can go. This can go.
<clears throat> you got to clean as you go. I fuck with Powerade. You guys like Powerade or Gatorade better? I fuck with Powerade. And there's a few Gatorades I like, like Original Blue or like the White Cherry. Other than that, it's Powerade for me. Yo, white cherry is fire. Cucumber lime, what the fuck? You just have to be extra thrashing Tony. <laughs> it exists. I gotta go find it. I haven't had that in a minute. Unless they don't make it anymore. It does exist. <laughs> I was riding that white cherry for a long time. <laughs> Fucking cucumber lime, you know what I'm saying? That's hilarious. I love it. It's probably hella refreshing. Yeah, I don't know. Gatorade's like too sugary for me or something. I've been crushing liquid IVs like every day. I got uh I got watermelon, fruit punch, and golden cherry. I think I like watermelon the best. Agua fresca, yo, those are fire by Minute Maid. Those are dangerous. There's like a hib hibiscus one I had. I don't got all these exotic flavors though. What about soda? I don't really drip fuck with soda that much. The only soda I really drink is wild cherry Pepsi. It's the only way, only one. I'm a Pepsi guy, not a Coke guy. I like Pepsi better. Coke Zero? I haven't had a Coke Zero in forever. Freaking coconut, no, cucumber, lime, Coke. What are they doing with Dr. Pepper? They're adding like hella shit to it. I'm soldering and I'm like itchy.
Wow, I just skipped the whole row. Because the PCB is so easy to solder. Thank God. What else? What else? What else, chat? Oh, we got to add. Oh, is that, is that, uh, is anyone going to get Warhammer 40 K? That game looks sick. I'm definitely going to play that. I've never played any of the other ones and I don't know the storyline. So I got to watch something or do something. Not into Warhammer. Isn't Henry Calvin supposed to make a movie or something or a show? Elite Dangerous. I feel like I've heard of that. Is that the space game? Do you have like a whole rig, like a whole stick and pedals and everything for the ship?
Hand on second throttle, no pedal. That's crazy. That's probably a lot of fun. So what do you do? Do you just build your ship and you can fight? In space? Hopefully this PCB works because we honestly, I honestly didn't even test it. I'm like a, I'm like a beginner here. Forgot how to build a keyboard. Does it, I wonder if the PC top variant has RGB PCB. Double check. Everything's soldered. I guess it's in all the way. It doesn't look like it. Perfect solder joints chat. All right, let's clean up. I'm going to go wash my hands because we did just touch leaded solder.
I got my sh I got my streaming buddy. She is asked out. I'm deaf joining this GB, this board. Oh, the board's so fucking clean. I saw this board and I was so happy I got to be a part of the like proto builds. crazy that there's this many screws. Copper bottom, hell yeah. Yo, Inamuski, what's good he? How you doing? I like the look of the double screws on each corner, makes it kinda industrial. Yeah. I like the I like just like the fact that they use torques. Ooh, look at this cut. I gotta show you guys this cut. Bill's going pretty good. Typing test? What the frick? I'm not doing that. I gotta show you guys this angle. These screws are so nice. Nice socket cap. Torx. Look at this cut. That's in this board is just f insane. It's so sick. I might just be using this board for a while. Just this board. I might just like it better than one of the TGR boards I just built. <clears throat> this is beautiful. Even the internals, right? I'm assuming this has to help with some sort of acoustics. The ridges. And I love how I love how the copper weight shows through this. And the void. I love how they did that with the slash through it. Anaraxis. It's just so hot. It's such a hot, crisp board. All right, I'm just going O-ring off a rip. And what's what's really cool about this O-ring than like other O-rings is that there's no USB port to accidentally rip off. Which is very scary sometimes when you're putting these on. You got like a little USB right here and you got to put it behind it.
nice little channel for the JST connector. Oh, this board's so hot. I see this board doing really well. Lantern, what the freak, dude? 45 freaking months. Holy shit. <clears throat> what? <laughs> My God. Bro, I've been streaming for four years. <laughs> this is fucking nuts. I gotta get a life chat. What the hell? The JST port might get fucked up. Better not get fucked up. Ooh, the cherry lip. Oh, thank God. Thank freaking God. Oh, the cherry lip. God damn. Anaraxis, yo. All, all in the legend right there. Anaraxis. Thank you so much for the tier one. Oh my God, the cherry lip. I totally forgot about the cherry lip. That's it. Itamuski, I'm not, I'm straight nutting over this board right now. I can't help it. It's too good. It's too good. My God, I'm sweating. It's hot. I was starting to feel good. Now I'm feeling sick again. This board's getting me excited. Copper weight. Mm. Mm. All right, no cat hair. Sorry. Ooh. Ooh, a nice little flathead undercut screw. I can appreciate some nice hardware, you know what I'm saying? This scares me a little bit. The screws in between the... This polished stainless. Ooh. All right, let's put these press feet in here. Ooh. That's tight. They don't feel cheap. A lot of them feel cheap. These are thick and they press fit right in. Is this even a proto? Is this like production? Not. Not. Fuck. Ooh, switches match really good. I didn't know how well they were going to match. I honestly just went in my switch 
cabinet and just found similar blue switches. I just looked at the board once. Ooh, Shoko. God. Chat. Chat. <laughs> Firefly? I don't know if I have Firefly. I don't even know if I know what Firefly looks like. Shoko? Dude, Shoko's too perfect. I took this off of one of my other favorite builds, so... I got a good feeling. This is how I store my GMK sets. It's a lot easier than this. The boxes they give you. My, I don't know. If, I don't know. This might be too clean for artisan. The peach color of the ledge. Oh shit, that would be cool. Are those switches? We're going to find out. They sound really good. The lubrication's really good. Um, they felt really good in the hand. That sounds sus as hell. Uh, the finishing, it should be, yeah. I think it's Anna. Sports freaking hot. I mean, come on, did we not match this good? I honestly haven't been this excited over a keyboard in a while. I ain't gonna lie to you guys. I tell you guys how it is. I went all out. I maxed out on this. Max brain power. Trying to avoid not trying to avoid of pouring this out because I see all the caps I need here.
Oh my god, this board's fucking sexy. Very excited. Something nice that's not PKL. Yeah. I was honestly over 65%. Like, I, I could honestly care less. But this board's crazy. I was just tired of seeing the same old shit. I love this cherry lip. God damn. And then like when you're looking at it head on like this, it hides everything else that it has under underneath. Like it's just stacked. The stats are stacked here. Like, even if I wasn't gonna, if I wasn't able to review or do anything on this board, I was gonna buy one. I was gonna get in on it. I don't know why I just like couldn't think that was caps lock. Nah, no step. No step. I wasn't feeling the step. It's because the keyboard I took this off of had step. And I was like, eh. My tripping out. Where is the uh Boom. Isn't the cherry lip clean? This is new meta. Meta. Fucking meta. 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 Jeez, this board's hot. Subtle branding, like nothing crazy. Thank you, Chris. Clean. All right, Zeus. Oh, wait. Let me make sure it works. I got scared. I was like, I can I not fit this USB cable in here? Alright. Ooh, I typed on it, chat. Nah, it works. It works. I got faith. I got faith. I don't, I'm not running no. I'm not checking nothing. The fuck? This is breaking.
All right, chat. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, chat. All right, all right, we're back. All right, so this is the Void 65% with the Alu Plate, Bison Paradise linear switches, TX, APTX stabs, topped off with GMK Shoku. Shit. Keep signing thanks to the follow. We got hype in the chat. Someone eat chips? Why does it sound so crispy? Sheesh. Let's freaking go. I'm freaking hype. Glad the PC. Yo, so am I because we didn't even test it. Can't even type. My fingers are broken. It's so goddamn crispy. Say faith. We got. I had faith in this board. You know what I'm saying? Sir, take my money. Facts. We'll hit you with the F key. We'll pay with some respects. Big W. Give it up for Anaraxis and check. I gotta get this other keyboard off my desk.
Money. That's it. This is it. I don't need another keyboard. I'm lying. I need more keyboards. Oh my God, chat. I'm fumbling. Keyboard's hot. What do you guys think, chat? <clears throat> I have a hot swap PCB, but like, do we need to rebuild it after that? Do we need another build after that? Sounds perfect. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. This is literally perfect. I really like these switches. These B Sun Paradise switches. If you guys want to check these out, you guys can check it over at uh, Uni Keyboards or Uni, yeah, Uni Keyboards. You guys use my code at checkout. But these switches are freaking nice. Bottom out 50G, kind of nice and light. Long pole, 22 millimeter double stage spring fire. Uh, let's, um, Let's, uh, air chat. You, you need another 65%. All right. Group I starts in 18 days chat. Get your freaking wallets ready. The 9th of September. Oh. That's a sick pick. Behind the logo. The O in void carries multiple meanings, each adding depth to design. Philosophy, it can represent zero, symbolizing nothingness and the concept of a void. It also signifies a starting point as beginnings often start from zero. The idea of void implies emptiness, suggesting a space full of potential and possibilities, ready to be filled with creativity and innovation, which is what we just did. <laughs> oh shit don't mind that i was i like it hey i like the drunk thinking you know what i'm saying you never know what comes out of that Ooh, look at this chat you can mess with i like this you can see 360 around the board That's sick. I really like it. This board, this board is a must. Honestly, I'd have FOMO if I didn't get it. You got your top case, bottom case, bottom weight, rear weight. Ooh, ooh. Number five is what does it does it for me. Oh, so that's what that was. The bottom case, which I thought were acoustics, are actually a gutter system for the surface mount components on the PCB. Interesting. I mean, does it, it doesn't flex that much? It doesn't really flex that much. Two eighty for like bare bones aluminum kit. So if we went stainless, we went blue, uh, alu. If you got another PCB, so three ninety for the setup I have. That's not bad. 
Yeah, I think it helps acoustics as well. This board's fucking dope. I like it. Adds more volume, yeah. Or else it would just kind of be dead. I like all the crazy cuts. Like when you take off this back weight, the board has some pretty crazy depth to it. I'm surprised for 390. I like it's pretty cheap for this board. Especially with the stainless and copper kit. Like if you just get aluminum kit, 285, that's not bad at all. I'm curious how much more the acoustics uh, change. Of course, you got your dual mounting options, chat. I mean, this is so fucking sick right here. This is, a, this is the blue I have. Blue looks pretty close. What color is that? Gray? Polycarb, sheesh. Funky, crazy layout options on the solder PCB. Then you have your pretty standard on the hot swap. You're not changing much. You're getting the 7U space bar, step caps, uh, and then your split backspace. You're not going to get the uh, extra layouts over here. 23 really it doesn't seem that high what is it is that is the 23.5 to here not to here because to here it doesn't seem like that seems a little bit lower oh okay <laughs> Wait after assembly. 1,962 grams. Let's see. Come on, chat. I got a scale for freaking keyboards. You know what I'm saying? What's wrong with you guys? Close. Close. One point nine kg. Four. 5.7 pounds. Four pound keyboard. I don't know, chat. This board's sick. What else? I'm going to finish this web page. I really like this website. Your website's like done really good. I like the font. I like how simple it looks too. There it is. Click clack. Yeah, you're also getting a stainless back piece. Yeah, um, I'm I'm surprised about the price point. It's a good price point. I like it. Stainless is harder to machine than copper. Copper, I believe, is softer. We'll add it to hell yeah. I'll uh, right after stream, I'm gonna upload it to YouTube. And then I'll, I'll DM you when it's live. Like maybe I'll do it tomorrow morning. It might take a little, a little bit for YouTube to 
do its thing. But uh, yeah, I'll post it on YouTube. That way it's there forever. We have the receipts forever, chat. All right, chat. We're going to go raid somebody. Who's streaming? You guys want to go raid? Uh, okay, Bob. Let's go raid. Okay, Bob. I need to plug in the keyboard chat. Ooh. Oh, I didn't even, I didn't even copy it because my keyboard wasn't plugged in. Oh my God. My backspace is binded to one. Um, cool. All right, chat. Appreciate you guys hanging out with me tonight. Pick up those boards September 9th. Uh, if you guys are in the US, Click Clack is the vendor. Um, Interaxis, thank you so much for uh, allowing me to build this. It's a beautiful board. Can't wait to take some photos. Um, do a sound test. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do my magic. Try to make the board look uh, the best I can. Um, yeah, thank you guys for all the follows tonight. Thank you guys for the sub. Big sub from Lantern. 45 months in a row. What a freaking savage. Almost four years. That's dedication. Um, but yeah, I hope everybody has a good night. Enjoy Bokeh Bob's stream. Um, what is he doing? Arc 60. I wonder if he's doing a plateless. I built my Arc 60 back in the day plateless. That's another really good board. Um, but yeah, I'll talk to you guys in the discord. If you guys have any more questions about the void, you guys could talk to me in my discord. If you guys need the, there's a discord channel. Here's my YouTube. If you guys want to go back and watch the VOD and if you guys want more content, um, here's an Instagram, but yeah, guys, it's counting down. Peace out. Hope everybody has a great night.